Hello and welcome to the Minutes Within the Mist, where we journey the dark and clouded unknown places to find ghosts and other mysteries to present to you. Today, we'll tell about a vengeful witch known as the Grey Lady of Westwick. There is a local legend since the 1600s that state if you drive down a forest road after midnight, then you will see the Grey Lady of Westwick. She is, according to folklore, a witch who seeks vengeance on men who have wronged women, such as wife beaters, adulterers, and killers. The lady possesses the ability to take many forms, but you will always know her by her gray clothing that she wears, and her teeth will be yellow and rotting because once she's killed her victims, she feasts on them. One story tells of a John Watkins who had heard the legends of the vengeful ghost, but he did not believe in the supernatural. He had a history of being a womanizer and a heavy drinker. He was driving home after such a night of drinking and gambling. As he drove in the darkness, that is when he saw a young girl shivering beside a battered car on the side of the road. Her eyes gave the look of a deer caught in the headlights, and her black hair was cropped short much like a pixie cut. She looked fearful, but she was waving him down nonetheless. John offered the girl a lift. After a bit of small talk, the married man began to flirt with the girl, becoming bolder as the drive continued. Soon, he even moved his hand to her thigh, offering that they could stop for a bit if she wanted. The girl agreed, and John found a secluded place to pull over. Once stopped, he made a comment about how beautiful she was, which caught her off guard. Instead of smiling with closed lips as she had done previously, she smiled properly, showing a row of yellow and crooked teeth. He realized who she was, but it was too late. The girl slid a knife into his chest. However, it was not the knife that killed him. The panic and fear stopped his heart long before the blade even pierced him. So, was Watkins killed by a plot concocted by his wife, or did he encounter the actual ghost? I hope you enjoyed these tales of the Grey Lady of Westwick. For more ghost stories and urban legends, join us at the Within the Miz podcast. Until then, drive through the darkness safely and remain constantly curious.